what's up? This is Chris from Electrofames. Today I want to show you another tablet of the so famous brand Pipo. So for the people who don't really know Pipo, Pipo is a very good brand which is uh, making tablets mostly. And um, so today I want to show you the, the S3 Pro. So we can have a look first uh, at the package quickly. So it's pretty tough and the design is pretty nice too. So if we can have a quick look on the back. So here we could see that this is like a 16 gigabytes uh, black. So we can see S3 Pro, the barcodes, all the information relative to so full HD. But we will go through all the specifications later on. Okay. So just to show you, so just quickly to introduce it, you know, so it's a seven inches uh, tablet. Um, okay, let's have a look first. So this is it. Okay, leave it inside. So inside of the box, um, we do have so the DC in uh, charger, as you can see. So this is a European plug, but uh, we can get a UK or US plug, you know, up to you. You just let us on, let us know before and we can do it, okay? Otherwise, except that we do have actually a USB charger. So, micro USB, USB. Um, and that's not it. We also have and next, a female USB, as you can see here, and a micro USB, and the last item of the box is earphones. So I can show you quickly. So made by people. So I've been testing them, and uh, for me personally, uh, I think I pretty much like you know the the good bass. The quality is globally good and a good rendering, and uh, so those are in ear, and they're pretty comfortable and uh, only on black, you know. So that's it for the box basically. Um, now we can. Maybe have a look at the tablet itself. So, so here we go. So seven inches tablet. So we can check it out just quickly. So about the connection ports, uh, what do we have? So if we go okay here like that. So here we can see that we do have like a TF card until 32 gigabytes, a USB host, HDMI, the 3.5 millimeters jack, the volume button and the power button. Here's a speaker as well. So here are all other specifications. You can see. Here we do have the DC in and the reset. And if we go all around, now we can see here the camera. So this is a two megapixels camera, back camera. And on the front, actually. We do have this camera, if we can zoom on it. Okay. So this is uh, 0.3 megapixels, okay? So that's for the, the main aspect of the tablets. Uh, so this is like a, a plastic, uh, pretty tough to be honest, a plastic um, back cover. So, so hey, globally, that's it enough for the presentation of the 
of the tablet so best now is just to to get started and see what's going on okay let's turn it on then all right people so this tablet has a resolution of 1024 by 600 it's an IPS screen and uh, the main specifications are 1 gigabyte of RAM and 16 gigabytes of ROM basically and it's using the Mali 400 MP for the GPU so still starting and it's using Android uh, 4.22 okay so we will check everything in details once we get started get a bit of time but believe me after it's pretty fast here we go so as you can see here the frame is like uh, 69 and it's a resolution of 1724 600 so basic Android 4.22 so we can check it's alright so we can have first right away a look on Antutu benchmark so for the people still who don't know what is a benchmark, you know, it's just like evaluating your device, comparing that to other devices. And um, and at the same time, it's giving you like the device in full. So all the specifications, the detailed specifications, okay? So here we go. We already did the score for you. So this is a score of 20,541, which is actually not too bad. You know, we can... Actually, go to ranking and to the bar chart here, and if we do like that, we can see that the S3 Pro is here, you know. So you can check that it is not too bad, you know, especially for such a price. So if we go back to, uh, to device info, this is actually what we want to see. Yeah. So here we go. Let's go step by step. So this is a. Pipo F3 Pro 4.22 Android Quad Core ARM V7 so, um, Cortex A9 eh? Mali 400 MP for the GPU 1024 by 600 2 megapixels from back so here we can see we do have 16 gigabytes of RAM and 1 gigabyte of uh, internal memory uh, 1 gigabyte of um, RAM sorry so quad core clocked at 1.6 gigahertz um, Mali 400 um, 160 dpi so dual camera 2 megapixels on the back and 0.3 megapixels on the front 4.22 Wi-Fi for the um, sensors it's actually pretty surprising so we have everything so we can hear except the um, temperature and relative humidity sensors okay that's it you know this is the only thing missing for the sensors so it's very good it's pretty not not too bad at all so if we go back and uh, we go back to the menu here i want to to know actually if we have the the root on that root access for quickly for the people who don't really know what is the root just allows you to have like more more permission on your on your device to install other applications and to modify the system as much as you want and to change the the firmware for example whenever you want so here you are root so it means like you can do actually whatever you want you can update the firmware change the firmware change the android version do whatever you want okay with a bow yeah, with avoiding the, bar the warranty basically, okay? So please bear that in mind. So I want to test the multi-touch now for you. So I, I've done a, an application before. So just to show you quickly, you know, one you can put all your fingers and we have, so it's a 10, 10 touch capacity screen. And, um, so now we can have a look actually okay so I forgot to show you something at the beginning actually which is quite important eh? so the settings first eh? 
so we have okay Wi-Fi, Bluetooth, uh, so display HDMI, so this possibility of Miracast too, uh, storage, uh, we already saw it, location access security, languages, that's what I wanted to show you. So in the languages, we actually have uh, all languages, so you can check it by your own, it's a lot. So if you don't find yours in that, here we go. Okay, so it's really a lot. No? So except languages, like uh, results, the same like a basic Android. Okay, we can check that just to show you if you want that. So S3 Pro official. Okay. All right, so that's it for the um, for the specifications. So you can see, and even the um, the background is pretty nice. You know, like with these clouds, you know, moving at the same time, it's pretty smooth. All right. So now I want to show you a good video to check the sound and check the um, kind of the graphics if I can find it. Explore. Okay, so we can go to inter memory. I think I'll put that there. Okay, here we go. So this is a video of uh, GoPro. So which is like in a uh, in SD. Okay. So it puts all the sounds to the maximum. Here we go. So we can check the angles. Sorry about the reflections, you know, but the sun is not that easy. So it's over expensive. No worries about that. Okay. We can go a bit further. So the sound is not too bad. It's not too many bass, but it's pretty bad and to be honest, you know, only for me. It's quite a lot of power anyway. So we can check a bit further if you want. And the quality is pretty impressive anyway. So it's all HDMI, okay? Right. So. Okay, that was just to show you all of that. So now I would like to show you maybe a game, you know. So we have this good game. Asphalt 8, you know, for the people who knows, you know, this is like one of the, not to be pretentious, the best game at, at the actual market, but um, a very good game with good graphics, you know, so let's just try to see how it goes, you know, with this Mali 400 MP GPU and, uh, and with the main specifications of the tablet then, okay. Here we go.
So as you can see, it doesn't lag at all. It's correct. Alright, okay. Just to show you, it's working all perfect. The tilt here is working out, and the reflection is not crazy. So, just to show you that you can actually play to the latest games, you know, without any worry at all, okay? The graphics are very nice. Okay? Okay, so no need to, to go any further. I'm here to play a lot of games. So just to show you that, and um, so I'll show you the main specifications so to to summary what is going on with this tablet. Uh, basically, so this is like the S, the Pipo S3 Pro. Um, so. S3 Pro, which a resolution of 1024 by 600, a 7 inches IPS screen tablet um, with um, TF card, HDMI, USB, and uh, it's a quad core, uh, 1.6 gigahertz with a uh, Mali 400 MP, 1 gig of RAM, one, uh, 16 of ROM. Um, two dual um, two cameras, one on the back of two megapixels, and one on the um, one on the front, which is like 0.3 megapixels. Um, I want to say that the, the battery is actually a 3,200 mAh, which allows you maybe to to play around for six eight hours probably. And um, the thickness, I forgot to say that, so you can see here it's not too much, so the thickness is actually uh, 10.7 millimeters, and the weight is pretty comfortable, it's not that heavy, it's like 340 grams, which is correct for this kind of tablets. So, so that's it for the, for the S3 Pro, so you can, you can buy it on our website at uh, 109 uh, point ninety nine euros. So feel free to visit uh, www.electrofame.com. Uh, in the comments, you will see the link, which directly leads to um, to the description of this tablet for more information. So I hope you enjoy it, and uh, if you have any questions, just let us comment, and uh, we will get back to you as soon as possible. Thank you. Bye bye.